We recommend that you clean the transmitters after every use to ensure that there is no buildup of ultrasound gel on the transmitters and for hygiene reasons. To do so, ensure the device is turned off, unscrew the transmitter, and you'll notice that it will come apart into two pieces, your plastic shell and the metal part of the transmitter. To clean your transmitter, you can use an ultrasonic cleaning bath. You can run these parts under cold water or you can use an alcohol wipe. Clean around the plastic casing and the transmitter itself, ensuring you move any ultrasound gel from underneath the O-rings. Once you've done this, allow your transmitter to dry for reassembling and reconnecting to the device. So the second part of the cleaning process is to ensure that the handpiece itself and the barrel is cleaned. We suggest that you do this as a minimum of once a week. Again, make sure that the device is switched off and the handpiece disconnected. Firstly, remove the transmitter. Then, using your spanner, remove the barrel. Place this to one side and remove the grip. Tap the handpiece into your palm to remove the projectile and place it somewhere safe. Then, to clean your handpiece, clean around the inside of the barrel, removing any dust or debris that may have accumulated there. And, using your cleaning brush, clean down through the guide tube, again removing any dust or debris. Once you've done this, you can reassemble your handpiece. It reinsert the projectile into the handpiece. It will automatically self-center. Attach the grip. Ensuring it's secured. And then reattach the barrel. Use the spanner to ensure that this is fully secured. Finally, you can reattach your transmitter, reconnect the handpiece to the device, and you're ready to continue treating your patients.